Yeah, so I'm in my car thinking about why rainforests are getting cut down, even though it seems like a lot of people do sort of think that they're, they're a good thing to have around, they're interesting and useful. And I do too, I mean, I think rainforests are really neat. Um, what I've heard is that basically when it comes down to somebody deciding whether they have to cut down the forest to make a little bit of money to feed their family or not, um, then they're going to decide to cut down the, the rainforest. And that's an understandable feeling. Um, I just want to think about like, do people really need to be making so many families, right? Is, is there such a need? It's, it's kind of like humans have turned into a machine that just converts matter and energy into more human beings. And I think that it's, it's very useful uh, for a society to have a large number of members uh, in some sense. Um, but there is, there is a point of diminishing returns on that. So when we were a young species and very limited in number, and struggling against a lot of difficult things, you know, like living in the in uh, Africa and living with you know limited resources, uh, resources that are difficult to access, and living with a small population. Uh, it makes sense that all of our instincts would be tuned to kind of keep our population as high as possible. So basically, just programmed to convert all matter and energy around us into more human beings and just have those con convert more matter and energy into more human beings. And I think that's pretty much how humans operate uh, naturally. That's why they like to have um, families that have a number of children. That's, that's kind of why you, it, it's a, it's the evolutionary underpinning of a lot of things uh, that people do, you know, get food, they meet other people, they have families. Uh, love their children, take care of their children, all of that is, you know, that, that process of converting mat matter and energy into more human beings. But at this point, now that we've got 7 billion on the planet, I mean, I think people should probably step back and think, do you really need to um, create so many more people? Uh, and if you're sucking up all these resources and destroying a lot of interesting stuff to get more and more people, uh, arguably, it's not really necessary. Once you've got a population that's big enough, like at 7 billion and it's spread all over the world, um, all different continents, uh, it's basically stable. Uh, you've got enough. And to grow beyond that, you, you probably actually want to start going to different planets and stuff instead of just jacking the population on one planet higher and higher. So anyway, that's the thought. Just wanted to document it. Uh, let me know if you have any thoughts or comments. Thanks.